These days, with stocks and records and volatility elevated, we're hearing a lot of talk about bubbles. But is the stock market in a bubble? And is it ready to pop? Spoiler alert, we don't think that the stock market is in a bubble, even if some investors do. Let me show you what I mean. But what even is a stock market bubble anyway? Let's use an example from the turn of the millennium, the infamous dot-com bubble. We all know the story. Investors piled into any company that was internet related. Their prices increased dramatically, but the internet wasn't quite ready to deliver on its promise. It was dial-up after all. Pop goes the bubble. Fast forward to today. Even after the rally from the March lows, we still don't think the stock market is in a bubble. And there are two main reasons why. First, let's talk about valuations by considering how much investors are willing to pay for every $1 of earnings in the year ahead. There's no denying that stock markets look expensive relative to their own history, but that's not the whole story. Stocks aren't a bargain, but relative to bonds, you'll actually find that stock market valuations are actually pretty reasonable. So how do you compare the stock market to the bond market anyway? First, you need to figure out how much their earnings from the stock market are yielding you. Then you can compare it to the yield from the bond market. Right now, the yield from the earnings on the equity market are about 3.5% higher than the yield from the bond market, right around the 20 year average. Now let's get to my second reason. The stock market is rising because investors understand the strength of the economic recovery. Yes, there are still some signs of strain, but there's also a lot of pent up consumer demand. People can't wait to get out of their houses to go travel, shop, go to a restaurant, maybe even a bar. And the good news is that there's a lot of excess savings on consumer balance sheets. In our view, this healthy consumer will help drive corporate earnings and help the stock market grow into its valuation. So, based on both of those reasons, we don't think that the stock market is in a bubble. But that's not to say that you shouldn't be mindful about how much risk you're taking with your investments. We believe that the global economy will continue to heal in 2021. And you can embrace the optimism by getting and staying invested.